This video is brought to you by, AE Juice, get ready to use professional and easy to use transitions and presets, glitch animated background, logo reveal, text animation, different smooth transitions, trailer titles and many more, you can get them individually or you can get it in a bundle. It's also available for Premiere Pro and After Effects. Check out the first link in the description. Hello guys, welcome back to my another After Effects tutorial. In this After Effects tutorial, we are going to create this. Here you can see, I have imported the file required for this project. You can download them from below link in the description. Now let's see how to create this title. Create a new composition. I will name it as trailer title. Set time duration to 3 seconds. Create a new solid layer. This will be our background layer. Now in effects and preset, search for gradient ramp, add it to the solid layer, now set start and end color as shown. Adjust the position. Ramp shape to radial ramp, ramp scatter to 500. Now let's add the texture media file to the timeline. Let's pre-compose it. I will name it as texture. Select move all attribute into new composition. Now let's add the text. Here you can add any text of your choice. Perfect. Now let's animate the text layer. From animate, select tracking. Set type to, after. Set tracking to, 1000. In range selector. Add start. Create keyframe for offset. Add 1 second, change offset to, 100%. Now in advance. Set shape to ramp up. Select randomize order on. Now add start, create keyframe for random seed. Now at 1 second, change random seed to 50. You can see the preview. Set easy high to 45%, easy low to 35%. For animator, let's add property, fill color. RGB. Set color as shown. Now let's add property blur. Unlink it. Set text blur to 400. Now press U to view keyframes, select keyframes. Change keyframe assistant to easy ease. You can see the preview. If you want to create the end animation, at end of the timeline, change offset to 0%, set random seed to 0. You can see the in and out effect for the text layer. Now let's pre compose the text layer, name it as text. For texture, change track matte to alpha matte text. Perfect. 
for texture composition in effects and preset search for curves add it to the adjustment layer slightly adjust the curves perfect now again add the texture media composition to the timeline add text composition to the timeline for texture change track mat to alpha mat text for texture in effects and preset search for glow add it to the texture composition for glow set glow threshold to 70 percent glow radius to 70 perfect now let's add the text composition to the timeline in effects and preset search for fill add it to the text composition set fill color to black now in effects and preset search for bevel alpha add it to the text composition set edge thickness to 0.80 light angle to 0 degree light intensity to 1 for text composition change mode to add now let's create two duplicates of this text composition for above duplicate remove the bevel alpha now in effects and preset search for cc light sweep add it to the text composition now at start position the center create keyframe for center now at end adjust the center as shown set shape to smooth set width to 60 set sweep intensity to 15 set edge intensity to 5 now add the particles media to the timeline change mode to add now create a new adjustment layer in effects and preset search for curves add it to the adjustment layer now slightly adjust the curves now in effects and preset search for sharpen add it to the adjustment layer set sharpen to 5 now again create a new adjustment layer in effects and preset search for tint add it to adjustment layer set amount of tint to 50 percent set color as shown Now in effects and preset, search for noise. Add it to the adjustment layer. Set amount of noise to 5. Now change all composition to 3D. Create a new camera. Create null object. Change null to 3D. Parent camera to null. For null, press P to bring up position. At start, create keyframe for position. Now at end, change Z position value as shown. You can see the preview. Perfect. Now let's create a new solid layer. Name it as frame. Double click on this rectangle tool to create mask. For mask path. Set unit to percent of source. Set top to 10%. Bottom to 90%. Select inverted. Now let's see the preview. Perfect. Similarly you can create multiple title and create your trailer. Thank you guys for watching this tutorial. See you next week with another awesome tutorial.